What up, bitches? Oh my god, it's been almost two weeks since I, uh, since I last streamed or really did anything substantial. But, you know, that's because, uh, I decided to make a video with my good friend Found from, uh, from, you know, he's a good friend of mine from high school. And we just decided to, you know, make a video to talk about the Nintendo 3DS and all the great memories it gave us. So, you know, uh, I spent, like, not even joking, a complete week editing that shit. And by the time I was done, I was just burnt out. I was drained. I was just like, okay, let's recharge for a little bit and just not stream for like a little while. So, you know, I'm back. Everything's fine. You know, I just had to get back into my routine. So, you know, we're here. We're back. Everything's okay. We can continue on from where we left off on the X, uh, on the X marathon. We already saw this before. But last time, uh, we played through X's campaign. Today, we are going to be playing through Zero's campaign. And I completely forgot to check my, uh... Hold on. I completely forgot to check my controls. Ah. Yeah, I gotta make sure that my, uh... Gotta make sure my beloved dash button is on the uh, left shoulder pad. Uh, there we go. There, there. Uh, yeah. Yeah, that. Yeah, that checks out. All right, let's do this. Now, Zero here, for whatever reason, has way more cutscene than X, so enjoy this. Great voice acting. Oh my god, it's... Well, I'm not going to spoil it, but, you know, that's that's a certain unit we'll be hearing about later. Oh my god. God damn Oh my god. Oh, Maverick. Maverick. Oh my god. Just the way that pronounced pisses me off anyways let's get into it so zero here he plays completely differently from x unlike unlike x who prefers to keep a distance and has the traditional uh, Mega Man gameplay zero here loves to be reckless and get up close and personal to his enemies and trust me I don't know man something about zero's gameplay style just vibes with me more that's why I always prefer playing a zero when it comes to this game. Ah, there we go. Oh my god, did I get a one-up already? Whenever I replay X4, I'm always going to be replaying Z as zero. You can believe that. Sure, I have to go through more cutscene, but hey, whatever. Oh, hey, this scene looks a little familiar. Totally not sus. Damn! If the Sky Lagoon falls, it'll be disastrous! There's no time! I'm going down! Ready. The carnage, it's horrible. Those Mavericks will pay for this! Sorry, I, I cannot sound cool for the life of me, so you're gonna have to deal with my crappy Zero voice. I can't- Lucas Gilbertson, I am not. Shoutouts to him, by the way. He meant, he redubbed some of the cutscenes from X4, and holy shit, he knocks it out of the park. I, it, it's a shame that he's basically retired from voice acting, though. I hear he's a full-time game dev now, so, hey, uh, 
chase your dreams in a different way, I suppose. But yeah, it'd be cool to get to hear him at, at Zero at least one last time, you know? God, I love Zero's voice. Iris, what are you doing here? Are you okay? Zero, did you come to save me? Yes, hang on. A huge maverick appeared and... Stay here, Iris. I'll handle it. Is this really one of Repla forces? I don't have a moment to spare. I have to defeat him or else... I'm not going to be voicing every cutscene, so uh, don't get used to it. My wonderfully stellar... My wonderfully stellar grade A professional voice acting. Anyways, here's that big dragon boss again. Uh, he's going to be going down like a chump pretty soon. Wow, it didn't even take a single hit. You know, that's just how intro bosses for Mega Man X go. You know, I've, I've made the joke like four times already, but they're big, they're intimidating, but damn, do they not put up a fight. Zero, long time no see. Colonel, what are you doing here? I've come to save my sister, Iris. I only hope she's okay. She's fine, I just rescued her. Oh, thanks, Zero. I owe you one. Colonel, I have a question for you. Did your unit attack this place? What are you talking about? Repliforce has come here to help. We weren't involved in the attack. They suspect you've become a maverick. What? Disarm and come back to the headquarters. I'm afraid, I'm afraid I can't. Soldiers never drop their weapons. I won't do it. Not even for you, Zero. Then they'll think you're a maverick. So be it. The Repla Force prefers war over. The Repla Force prefers war over dishonor and shame. Goodbye, Zero. Wait, Colonel, listen to me. You dumbass. This all could have been avoided. Damn, this isn't good, Colonel. They may decide the entire Repla Force is a group of mavericks. Fucking dumbass. Should've just dropped his weapons. Just been like, oh, okay. Well, I'll come in. I'll, I'll answer questions. Could have cleared up. This whole game could have been avoided. God damn. Also, Iris is our navigator for this game. <sighs> Love having me a sup of just water. Anyways, here we have all eight Mavericks again. You know, blah, 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 blah. If you watched the X playthrough, you know exactly how this works. Or you've literally played any other Mega Man game. Like with X, I'm going to be going to Magma Dragoon first. Oh yeah, I should also mention that uh, when Zero takes on the bosses, it can be a little tougher. You know, because you don't have... I mean, Zero doesn't get the traditional Mega Man, you know, weapons. He gets uh, new abilities, new skills. And most of the time, they do not correlate to as weaknesses to Mavericks. So it's more of a... Uh, so it's more of a show of skill for the bosses. But yeah, you know, nothing too much different here. I do appreciate that uh, X4, you know, took into account both X and Zero. So, you know, you can play through the game comfortably as both of them. Oh! hoo hoo Oh, shit. I probably could have avoided damage there. Whoa. Oh yeah, by the way, you're going to be seeing me do that a lot. Uh, the Saber Dash cancel. Uh, especially on the bosses, because it just tears through their health like no tomorrow. Oh no! Why did I not dash? I could have dashed there. That's one death. All right, there we go. Then you jump over here. Oh, wait. Oh, my God. All right. Oh, my God. This is going to take a few attempts, so bear with me, folks. Yeah! 
first uh, first heart container down. Uh, I've been playing Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time lately, so I have some of that Zelda idea. I mean, I have some of that Zelda, you know, uh, dictionary on me. Anyways, uh, this part is simple as always. Just keep just keep dodging and slashing, dodging and slashing. And we are at the boss already. This is, once again, like the X playthrough, this is the one boss I will voice. Zero, it's really you. Why did you betray us? Answer me, Dragoon! I have no answer for you, my friend. Dragoon! And then they fight. Hadouken! God. I just love that they were so shameless about putting a Street Fighter reference in Mega Man. Uh, I mean, this wouldn't be the first time, so, you know. Hadouken! Alright, and like that, Dragoon is done. Wow, didn't even need to destroy the ride armor for this one. Ah, my... Oh, wait, there it goes. I wanted to defeat you. Then he appeared. He? Who? He told me he'd give me power. Only if I worked for Ripple Force. Hold on. Someone is knocking at my door. I'll be right back. Pardon the interruption. We are back to our regularly scheduled program. What? I couldn't refuse the offer. Sorry, Zero. Dragoon! Well, rip, <laughs> rip Dragoon. Ryujin. I, I can't pronounce that. Uh, sorry if I butchered that so badly. I'm so sorry if I butchered that. Look, man. They don't make it clear. I'm not going to make it clear. So... I actually do. I actually know a few friends who speak Japanese who'd probably give me some shit for that one. Anyways, onwards to Web Spider. He protects the secret weapon of the jungle. You know, I'm trying... I'm really trying not to repeat myself here. Especially on a lot of these stages, because, you know, for the most part, they do remain relatively unchanged. The only thing that's changed is the character I'm using. Yeah! Honestly, if you're playing at zero, you can probably go in any weakness order you want and probably get through the game just fine. Oh yeah, that's right. I'm not playing as... I'm not playing as X. Hey! All right. Yeah, this is this is why I love playing Zero. I can just be reckless and I get rewarded for it. D I don't know, man. Zero just has such a great flow to him. Oh wait, I can't save her dash cancel on this boss. I just kind of have to play it lame. And since I don't have to worry about uh, capsule upgrades, uh, Zero can just, you know, fly through the game. Whoa! Yeah! Who? God, I, I don't know, man. Just something about playing as Zero in this game is super satisfying. Yeah, huh? 
God, I love that. I love that attack so much. It is, it is as shameless a Street Fighter reference as you can get, but hey, you know what? Capcom, they love their cross-company references, so I can excuse it. And because I am a Street Fighter fan myself, you know, I don't mind it. Yeah! Yeah! Move! Yeah! Oh yeah, you can do this. Yeah! Who? Hey! Move! God, I love this fucking attack. I love this fucking attack. Yeah, yeah! Who? Yeah! Say! Like I said, the main, the main reason I'm doing these Mega Man streams again is because, you know, it's been over a year since I did anything Mega Man related. So, you know what? Let's bring back... Let's do the X-Series first, because that's kind of where I got my start here on Twitch. Well, my actual start on Twitch was with the Zero Series, so... Meh. Be purposely spreading false information about myself. Don't actually do that. For, for legal reasons, this is a joke. Ah, oh, shit. Sort of... Yeah... Oh! Oh! Yeah, I've always wanted to be like Zero, you know? And I'd say a little bit, in a way, I kind of have, uh... I think Zero was kind of like my... I think this is where my love of, uh, of red-clad heroes, uh, just kind of started. I mean, you got... I mean, some of my favorite characters of all time are associated with the color red in some way. So, uh, fun. Ah! Oh! Oh, shit. Yeah, this fight really isn't all that fun as Zero. Whoa! Go, fucking god damn it! Ah! I hate contact damage! Whatever. We'll just have to try again. If I get a game over tonight, I'm actually gonna cry. Although, I don't think I'm in much fear of that happening. Yeah, I shouldn't worry about it too much. Let's, just, let's try that again. Round two. By the way, uh, shout out to Cheat Freak for showing me how to mod my my Wii U in Minecraft. Sorry. Is that what he's saying? I don't know. Sorry. You know, I went out. Uh, when I went out, carry went out to karaoke with friends this weekend. Well, I guess it wasn't really all that much karaoke as much as it was uh, ranting about our shitty jobs. And then we did karaoke, so you know that was a lot of fun. A lot of uh, a lot of workforce workforce stories shared. So you know, that was cool. We all got to let out our feelings, and then you know we sang some songs. I think one of my favorites to sing was uh, Lincoln Park. In the end, and then we had, uh, and then I did a duet with Frank Sinatra, my with Frank Sinatra's "My Way." So you know that was cool. That was fun. I hit those long notes, man. Ah, I hate the mercy invincibility that this fucker has. Can't take him down with like, ah. Uh. I just hate it when bosses do that. They just have stupidly long invulnerability periods. But hey, web spider down. 
on to the next fight. Raijin Geki. Basically, this is a electric stab forward. If you wanted the, uh, if you wanted to know how they worked. Anyways, onward. I think next I usually like to go for Frost Walrus, so let's go with Frost Walrus. He protects the secret weapon which lies inside the snow base. Frost Walrus! Actually... Actually, I might have to revisit the stage later, but I'm probably going to be revisiting it anyways because I want to refill sub tanks and whatnot. Huh, yeah! 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 Huh! Wait, did I miss it? I think I might have missed it. Yep, there it is. Need to go back a bit. There we go. There's our second heart container. Oh, wait, third. Yeah, third. Yeah! You'll know if you got all the heart containers when your special meter and the, uh... And the health bar are the same. That's how I usually check, at least, for this game. Hoo -ha -hoo! Yeah! God, this... I don't know, man. I've said it before, and I'll say it a million times. I love Zero. He's my favorite character of all time. So, you know. I have to put, I have to put respect on my man's name. Okay, I don't think I can grab that yet. I need to double jump. I don't know why I went with Frost Walrus. Probably should have gone Jet Stingray. Oh, wait. No, hang on. Never mind. Yeah, I just realized Jet Stingray is... Yeah... Probably could have gone Split Mushroom. Er, wait, no. Ah, doesn't matter. Well, we'll, we'll fix it when we fix it. We'll fix it when we fix it. Oh my god. Just the utter deletion of that health bar. Just the utter deletion of that health bar makes me laugh. Holy shit. Rolled, LMAO. Lol, LMAO even. Alright, not much here, not much to complain about here. Man, I'll never forget the one time I did a I did a deathless X4 playthrough with Zero and I was just like, God damn it, should have saved the VOD just to prove that I did it. I don't know why. I'm a masochist for this kind of stuff, you know. Yo, know, just give me a game and I'll be like, yeah, I could do this in no one life, and then I end up eating shit somewhere along the line. Uh, it happened with X1, it happened with, uh... But yeah, it happened with X1, keeps happening with, uh... All the, a lot of the various other games I like to play. I'm just like, come on. Yeah, huh. Yeah! Who? Oh my god, slide!
Is this uh, is this where he? Yep. Oh lordy, coming! Here he comes. Blah 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 blah. Who cares what you have to say? L plus ratio plus didn't ask plus don't care plus you're a war criminal. And once again, he has that stupid fucking long ass invulnerability frames. I hate it. Like, just let me beat you up. I get that you're big, but still. And very heavily armored. Oh shit. Oh, they really. But yeah. Something I neglected to mention at the la on the last stream was just. How well animated these boss fights are. Holy crap, dude. Like. Like, you can tell it's a little budgeted, but like. They still tried their best to make sure that, like, they all looked good at least. Or at the very least, presentable. So, you know. Shoutouts to Capcom and... Frost Walrus is a character I relate to the most, and he's the future of the franchise. Neil Druckmann. More like Neil Drunk, man. <laughs> I'm funny. You got... I am not even gonna attempt to pronounce that, even though I attempted to pronounce the other ones. Holy shit. Once again, I, kn I have some friends who know Japanese, and they would probably hang my butt on a silver platter if I dared to butcher that. Oh my god, and then we got fucking... Jet Stingray! He destroyed the city and escaped to the sea. Jet Stingray! Jet Stingray. God, I love the stupid announcer in this game. Ready. Yes, I was indeed ready. Oh god, count, count how many times I'm gonna die trying to get the heart container and the sub tank. Real talk, Armor Core comes out this year and wins Goaty. We talked about this uh, on the weekend. I, it will absolutely happen. Uh, Miyazaki come, goes up to accept his reward. Oh wait, oh wait, I'm already holding it. Oh, son of a bitch. Okay, well, guess we're dying. I completely forgot that it's right there. My what? My two hundred gate? My two hundred dollar gaming chair just isn't able to handle me. Because I think it's starting to come apart a little bit. And yes, I spent two hundred dollars on a gaming chair. Shut up. I re I wanted one of the real fancy ones with RGBs and shit. Hey man, every part of my life has just been slowly being consumed by RGBs. RGB is the future, man. If your shit, if your shit ain't flashing like ten different colors, you have a secret lab, but it's not, but it's not worth the money. <laughs> What's a secret lab? <laughs> is this is that like one of those uh, high-end gaming chairs? Oh my old, oh my old keyboard was RGB too. Huh. Oh my god! Ah. How did I mistime that? Am I gonna need a game over here? Son of a bitch. Oh wait, I just realized this is another boss I can't Saber Dash cancel on. Damn it! Oh wait, actually I can if I if I'm patient enough. Oh. I'm not accepting that one. You, you can't, you can't see. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna go try hard sweat mode. Oh 
Oh no! Ah! Oh, now I have to replay this damn stage. Ah! All right, fine. I'll, I'll take the L against Jet Stingray. And then I gotta get a game over. This is fucking embarrassing. Ugh. Ah, shit. Oh, wait. All right, who do I fight again for the double jump? All right, I need to remember who I fight again for the... Like, it's been way too long since I last played this game. Ah, fuck. Actually, no. If I pull this off, I'm gonna actually cry. Alright, try hard sweat mode, engage. It's not over yet. Ah, shit. Fuck. Ah. All right. I got. It has been way too long since I pla last played this game. Holy shit, dude. I am out of practice. Probably should have done a practice run on this game, you know, like I did the others. But hey, thankfully, if I get a game over, I can just start over at the last checkpoint. So, you know, the game's forgiving in that regard. Still, I almost had him, man. I almost had him. Okay, there we go. Woo! All right, we're, why could I do that the first time? Jesus Christ almighty. All right, we're in. We're in. Doesn't matter. Let's clear this stage. Let's clear. All right, I think I got him on lockdown now. All right, try hard sweat mode engage. Oh my god, dude, what? Okay, he really seems to be like going for this move a lot. Alright, is he gonna dash again? Alright, we're in, we're in, we're in. We got this. Alright. He's gonna... Woo! Okay. No need to fear. We got this. I believe the dream is not dead. Oh, shit. Okay, well, I think the fight is pretty much over anyways, so... Yeah, doesn't matter. We got him. How could I do that the first time? Ugh. I'll never forget the time I actually managed to do this deathless. Holy shit, dude. That's so long ago. I've lost my touch at... I've lost my touch at X4. <laughs> Fuck my life. <sighs> Hien Kaku. Or Hien Kaku. Oh, fuck me. Please... Don't, please don't hurt me. Please do not hurt me. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Best, uh, best voice acting time. Get ready. Colonel. What? I'm disappointed in you, I'm disappointed in you Colonel. Ah! What do you think you're doing? It's not what do you think great. you're doing? Stop the coop now. 
Is that your decision? They went for a little... Actually, I'll explain it after. Spare your life for now, but next time there will be no mercy. Cyril, please don't fight with my brother. If you do, I'm afraid that one of you may end up. Someone must stop Repla Force. Cyril. Oh my God! <laughs> they found the most budget dollar store voice actors they could back in the day. Only. Oh, man. As much as I hate to admit this, only only Hideo Kojima really had, like, you know, access to good voice actors. So, you know, I mean, uh, well, I don't know where I was going with that, but the point is Metal Gear Solid 1 probably had the only decent voice acting from the time. He defends the military train to protect the supply of goods. Slash Beast. Anyway, okay, no, that's not the double jump, but we do get the air dash. Okay, now I remember, we get the double jump from Split Mushroom. I think. Don't quote me on that. So I probably should have gone Split Mushroom after I dealt with Web Spider. Well, whatever. What's done is done. We, we can only, you know, go through the game. Huh. Well, boy, ain't I gonna look like a tool or a square? Hoo ha hoo! Ha, yeah! Oh god, I probably shouldn't have done that. That's only really useful on bosses. Hey! Whoa! You know, I really do want to play the the PS1 version of X3 someday, you know. You know, just so I can see what it's like. I don't imagine it'll be too different from the SNES version, but, you know. It'd be nice to play through, you know, just for a novelty. And this is why I love doing the Saber Dash cancel. <laughs> Good lord almighty, I just tore through that boss. Or mini boss. Ready! God damn, dude. You know, I hear people say a lot that, you know... I curse way too much, and you know, I ain't gonna deny it, but you know, I don't like to call them curse words. I like to call them sentence enhancers. And I try to only use them, you know, when I think it'll make something go a little bit funnier. Here we go! And there's another freebie. Seriously, they just hand these things out like candy. Actually, the thing I want to get from Frost, Wal Frost Walrus's stage, you know, it only really gives me four lives when I game over, and, you know, the likelihood of that happening aren't, you know, very high, so, you know, I think I'm just gonna not go for it. Plus, I think I'll get a plethora of extra lives as the game goes on. Watch me, I'm gonna eat those I'm gonna regret those words someday, aren't I? Give it about 30 minutes, I'll regret those words. Oh my god. 
How many slashes do those things take? Okay, you know, I said that Frost Walrus was the oh lord he coming boss. Uh, I changed my mind. This is the oh lord he coming. Catch up! Alright. Finally, I can properly demonstrate Saber Dash cancel. You see that? You see that health bar? See how it's slowly going down? Oh god. Oh shit, counter! He's a Fire Emblem character in Smash Brothers, he has the counter. Damn it, I was a little off. Too early. You've got Shapuga! Okay, see, now that one I know. I think that's the spinning slash technique. Yeah, like, whatever. You know what I mean. Next up is, uh, you know, I'll... Eh, I'll take care of him now. Actually, wait. He occupies the laboratory and will attack whoever visits there. Split Mushroom! I think I did this with... I think I did this with just Vanilla X and I was fine. So, you know, as long as I... As long as I wall... Dash wall jump correctly, I should be able to handle this. No reason why I shouldn't be able to. I mean, we've all... We've already established that I am a competent Mega Man player. Yeah! <laughs> oh god, that was... That was almost a bad decision. Ha, huh, yeah! Hey! Oh, hang on. That, that was a Freeman. It's not over yet. I love how they try to make Zero's voice sound super cool in this game, and it just ends up... <laughs> he just ends up sounding like a fucking dork. I love it. Well, this is my favorite Mega Man X game, so... Uh, yeah. You know, after thinking over it a little bit more, yeah, this is probably my favorite Mega Man X game. Overall, I'd still say that X1 is superior, but, you know. I just love this one because it has so many fucking good options. And you can play a Zero. It's I know it's called Mega Man X and not Mega Man Zero, but I think he's a cool dude. Do that for maximum damage, and I think one more should do it. Ah, there we go. Yeah, <sighs> love me some water. Especially love ice, mm, ice in my water. Yeah, what? Oh shit. Uh, I should probably I wanna take uh I wanna take that emote and make it make it one of mine. Woo! Didn't even need the double jump for that one. Haha! -ha. Yeah, huh! Yeah, I think this is uh this is going really smooth. <laughs> oh wait, no. I couldn't cancel out of that. What the fuck? Oh 
Okay, yeah, that's the... Yeah, that's the... Uh, sh I don't want to... I don't remember. But yeah, the dash attack. You know, let's just call it that. And in X5, they make it somehow worse. Like a lot of things in X5. And here we go. And it's boss time. Sweat Mushroom is just as much of an annoying little shithead as he is in X's playthrough. Blah blah blah, who cares? Ah uh, shit, here he goes. This is where the fun begins. Not really. Nope, not today. It's not over yet. Alright, one more good slash and he's done. Alright, now we got the double jump. I think. I don't know. I could be completely wrong and I could look like a complete tool in less than 10 minutes. Yay! Oh, come on. I like it. I like it better than the SNES games where it's immediate. Cohen Boo. Okay, okay, okay. This is. I think this is the spinning jump slash. Yep. And the double jump. Ba 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 ba. He lives in cyberspace and wants to destroy the network system. I think this is the third of the Mavericks who's not associated with Repliforce. Let's, we'll see about that. Alright, yep, this is the beautiful double jump, which I love to have in every game that, that it's in. No! Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up! And we, did we get the S rank? Woo! Heart container, here I come. Oh, wait, no, it's a Freeman. Never mind. No! Come on, I can make it, I can make it. There we go. Freeman? Or... Sub tank? No, not hard container. Okay. Gosh darn it! Keep mumbling on my words, and I hate that about me. Oh wait, no. Zero actually has an easier time taking these little things out because he can actually just just use the spinning jump slash. No. Literally the easiest one to dodge, and I fucking just tank it like a loser. Come on, I can make it. There we go. Woo! Now I don't have to replay this stupid stage. Onwards to the next area. All right, here we go. Here we go. Anti-gravity puzzles. That's always fun. Or reverse gravity puzzles. Oh shit! Here we go. Oh shit! All right, and there they go. And boom. Alright, that's good. Move! Alright, onwards to Cyber Peacock. It was very flamboyant in the Japanese version. I mean, makes sense, but, you know. Blah, 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 who cares? And yes, he has the Sigma logo. I was right. 
Oh my god, I almost... Yep, there's his weakness. Another one of these bosses that has long, stupid <laughs> invulnerability times. No, not gonna, not even gonna give him the chance to use his signature attack. Hang on, not a chance, Buckaroo. Nope. Man, I'm just tearing these bosses apart. Whoa! Hey! Yep, and there she goes. Or he, rather. I'm sorry. <laughs> Why'd I say it? Why'd I say that? Yeah, yeah! Is yours delayed a little bit? Rakoho. What? I'm so sorry for butchering that. Rakoha! I think that's how it's pronounced. Oh well, whatever. I'm gonna have to consult my, uh. I'm gonna have to consult my JP expert. He left with. A space fortress to conquer the air. Storm Owl! Ready! ready. Yes, I am. But are you ready? Oh, shit. Oh, my God, dude. What the... Go down! Okay, we're good. God, I am so out of practice with this game. If, if this were me like two two years ago, I'd be able to clear this be able to clear this game without any like without any problem. But because it's been like oh actually, oh think about it. Oh shit. It's probably been longer for the X games. But I remember doing those in 2021. Oh my god, is it? Has it almost been two years since I last played any of the X games? Holy shit, what the fuck? Time, man! It's such a... Uh, it's such a fickle thing and I hate it. Huh! Yeah, yeah! Woo! Wait, did I get the... Yeah, I got it. Yeah, I got the heart container. Yeah! Move! <laughs> oh my god, it's just so fun to tear these Mavericks a new asshole. Ha! Alright, there we go. And then I miss uh, X's little plasma charge shot. ever seen anyone use that move, you know, the charge, the charge, uh, slash. I don't think I've ever seen one, anyone use that. If they have, uh, well then, they're a liar. Oh shit, what did I assign that button to? There, there it is. Get ready! Whoa! Woo! Oh, yeah. Get ready! Oh! Get ready! And he's done. It bothers me how weirdly inconsistent they are about, uh, about which lines they use from the JP version. Yeah, yeah. 
I forgot I've been doing I forgot to have been doing that. Tenkuha! Wait, huh? Friends online? Oh yeah, and that one just lets me slash up pellets or whatever. It doesn't matter. Alright, onwards to the Repliforce spaceport. Ready! Oh man, the Colonel boss fight is so much more fun with Zero since uh, since his X you can just cheese it out with the fourth armor and uh, you know because you can be at range. But the general fight is so much worse with Zero. I practically have to have two full sub tanks for that fight. I've already talked about this on Proto Blues' stream, but like, oh my god, Steve pisses me off so goddamn much. Minecraft Steve, I just feel like, I just feel like Steve in Smash Brothers just has way too many tools that just let him ignore the rules of the game, and I'm just like, can we please ban this character already? Sheesh. Sheesh! Don't care what you have to say. I've been waiting to fight with you. It's so unfair that X gets the fights gets to fight this dude twice. And not Zero. You know, his actual rival. Whoa! Oh yeah, yeah. Energy breaker. Yeah. I just love the colonel's voice whenever he's like not in actual cutscene. By the way, flashing light alert. Yeah. Alright, he's done. <laughs> wow, that was, uh... I didn't even get to yellow, what the hell? That was an easy fight. Yeah, again, this game in general is just way easier. <sighs> I know I'm missing... I know I'm missing the fucking special tank, but I don't give a shit. I don't need it. Oh, here's some good music. I unfortunately cannot find this particular track on YouTube, and I don't know why. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit, we're getting to the cutscene, boys. We're getting to the cutscene. Y'all better say it with me. <laughs> ah shit it's iris and look she's got that evil uh she's got that purple evil energy thingy i wonder what's gonna happen uh-oh mm -mm. okay i'll do it <laughs> Fucking delivery just does not work. So anyways, the, the basic plan here is just attack her a bunch and... I could have sworn there was an easier way to do this. Yep, there it is. There it is. That's the easier way to do it. Man, I would feel bad... 
I would feel bad for this if, well, the writing were a little stronger and not, you know, half-baked, but whatever. God, I never really... Like I said, I'm out of practice of this game for about two years, so forgive me for any scrubbish-like gameplay. I appreciate the little Repl Force logo, though. By the way, check out Mega Man Cross Dive. Me zero. By the way, check out Mega Man Cross Dive if you want to see what the potential original Reploid that uh, Iris and Colonel were supposed to be. Oh my god. Show your damn dark crystal. It's not over yet. Ah, I had to pop the sub tank. And pop another one. Because I forgot how to do this boss fight correctly. And there we go. Alright, enjoy the cutscene. Why the fuck do they keep... <sighs> ah, sorry. Enjoy the cutscene. Iris. Iris. Sarah. Hang in there, Iris. Please, stay away from Repliforce. Let's live together. In a world where only Reploids exist. Iris, there's no world just for Reploid. It's only a fantasy. Yes, I know, but I wanted to believe it. I wanted to live in a world where only Reploids exist. But you... <laughs> Iris! Oh. Iris! 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 Iris. Iris. <gasps> ah! No, no this, this can't be happening. happening. There's, There's no reason for me to go on. What? What am I fighting for? God. <laughs> Look, I know the scene has been memed to death a thousand times, but gosh darn it. If it isn't the most hilarious fucking thing I've ever seen in a Mega Man game. Like, oh my gosh, dude. Like, how could I not join in on the memeing? <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. That, that cutscene is just way too good. In all the wrong ways. Just kick, just kick Zero while he's down, why don't you? Like, I'm sorry, dude. I know your girlfriend just died and all, but like... <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, that's that's too good. Uh. All right, and here we have the worst boss fight in the game if you're playing a zero. All right, here it comes. I wasted all those sub tanks, so uh because <laughs> I didn't remember the correct way to fight Iris. Who cares what you have to say? Bozo. My fate is sealed. I, I have no, no choice. choice. Okay, there's two ways you can approach this fight. You can either do the boring way or the reckless way. <sighs> I'm gonna go for the reckless way because honestly I have no control over what I fucking do. Yeah, this fight sucks as zero. Because unlike X, you can cling to the walls and shoot from a distance. Zero has to get in up and close and personal. And sometimes you might even miss. This sucks. I hate this fight. I might... If I, if I lose here, I might just go and grab, you know, some, some sub-tank energy. Or I could just abuse mercy frames.
Come on, do the thing, General. Woo! All right. Am I gonna get a hit? Nope. All right, we're good. All right. I guess I'm gonna have to do this the lame way. Oh, God damn it. Oh, fuck me, I missed. Look at this huge ass motherfucker. Good Lord Almighty. Why'd they make him so big? I mean, I know he's the general, but like still, dude. Could have made him a little smaller, a little less intimidating. Oh, well, actually, now that I think about it, yeah. Kind of do need the military leader robot to be intimidating. Uh, so far, he's been cooperating, you know? So far, his AI's been cooperative, except not this time. Ugh. I swear to God. I cannot work with this. It's not over yet. Ugh. Like I said, there's no real way, easy way to do this with zero. You just kind of have to take it. Oh my god, and he's going for it again! Once again, this boss fight sucks with zero. I hate it. Yeah, that's right. You better come down here. Oh my god, he's too... Oh, wait, shit! Ah, my thumb! Ah. Dude, just come over! Ah. I honestly think they should have retooled this fight for zero. Oh my god. Even if you come close to him, you risk fucking just, like, dying. Ah, that's it. <sighs> I swear, over half the stream is just gonna be me fighting General. Because he refuses to fucking cooperate. It was our destiny to fight. It was our destiny to fight. Alright, seems to be cooperating so far. Okay. Alright, just keep doing what you're doing, General. Okay, this time he seems to be very cooperative. I won't even mind if he did the fist thing right now. Woo! Okay. Okay, am I getting am I getting the luck of the draw right now? Holy shit! <laughs> oh my god, this is beautiful. Oh shit. Okay, now he's gonna do like the fist thing like three times in a row. Wait, huh? Oh shit. Okay, now here it comes. I know there's some speedrunners who could probably do this in like less than a minute, but like, fuck me, I'm not learning that shit, dude. Come on. Just want your AI to be cooperative. Huge ass body. 
Oh my god! Yeah, you know, I should have should have just I should have seen the monkey's paw curl up. Should have known this is gonna be like a monkey's paw moment, you know, where like oh yeah, he's gonna he's gonna cooperate with like the first couple cycles and then he's just not gonna do shit for you. You know, I just had to tank it. Ugh! I think has a deceptively large hitbox, dude. Oh my god, how did I not hit that? Oh my god, this little bitch! Or, not little, but this bitch, dude! Yeah, I think they really should have retooled this fight for Zero. Because it's just a fucking waiting game, an excruciating one at that. Please, just cooperate with me, General. It. There it is. Oh, thank God it's finally over. It's been like a couple minutes on that fight. <sighs> that one fight. I hate it so much. Blah, blah, blah. Who cares what you have to say, bozo? Mm. I'm going to go fill up those sub tanks now. Just so I'm not scrambling in the final battle. Ready! Alright, what am I going to do here? You know, grab a few Freemans while I'm here. You know, just so things don't get completely cringe. And you know what? Because I feel like flexing, I'm going to do most of those uh, boss fights in the boss rush without their weaknesses. Yeah, I'll show you how it's done. I know I said not grab it, but you know, my, my, save, my heart would just not accept the save file looking barren with that one, you know, with that one missing slot. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Alright, yeah, that's one filled up. Ready. Here we go. Man. Shout out to my boy Blizzard Buffalo. My boy Blizzard Buffalo didn't deserve this. In the manga, he's actually a pretty cool dude, but then, you know, Frost Walrus decides to be a complete war criminal and just kill. <laughs> just kills Blizzard Buffalo. Oh my god. Bro, I still cannot find myself a physical copy of Metroid Prime Remastered. What is this shit, dude? Gosh darn it, Nintendo. Stock your products next time. Ugh, I'm getting flashbacks to the Xenoblade 3 Special Edition pre-orders. Ugh. 
All right, we're good. Ah, oh, darn. I probably could have just went into final weapon. Cool. All right, let's go. First up, I think this is Magma Dragoon. All right, here we go. The Amiibo Black Market. Hey, man, I'm younger than you, and I remember that shit. Bro, I wanted to find a Shulk Amiibo so badly, but that was GameStop exclusive, just like Xenoblade. There we go. God, that was so long ago. Almost 10 years ago. Almost 10 years ago. What the fuck? Anyways. <laughs> but yeah, you know, <laughs> things just... Uh, time moves forward, I suppose. All right, up next is Storm Owl. Oh, hey, look, it's Mumei's father. Get ready! Get ready! Whoa! Get ready! Oh, shit! Fuck! God damn it. Why am I taking a lot of deaths in this game? This is the easiest one in the series. Oh my god. Well then again, to be fair, I kind of did. I kind of did go into this one with, you know, low health. Get ready! Ah. I keep wasting his weakness. Oh my god, why do I keep taking damage? Oh my god! Ugh. I keep dying to the easiest shit, dude. Ah! I've lost my touch, dude. And I don't want to use my sub tanks either because I want to save them for the final battle. Oh no. There we go. Now we're getting it. Oh my god. There we go. There we go. <sighs> I'm out of practice, man. I'm not happy with how this run's going so far. Like, I would... Like, dude, a couple years ago, I'd be clearing this game with no deaths, no frustration, but, like, now it's like... Man, this is what happens when you put down a game for a couple years. Well, then again, I guess Storm Owl, Storm Owl is a pretty 
It's pretty tough. Storm Owl is pretty tough. There we go. I can do it, I can do it. There we go. You know, the movie trading company I usually go to has a Roy Amiibo. Don't know if I should go for it or not. By the way, when are the Pyra and Mithra Amiibos slated to come out? Oh shit, here he comes. When Wave 4 launches, when's that? Oh shit. All right, here we go. All right, I think I'm getting back into the groove. Yeah, I've seen the faces on some of those Sephiroth amiibos, and some of them just don't look right at all. Is it Split Mushroom? Yeah, it's Split Mushroom. All right, here he comes. Ah! There we go. Ah, I was was afraid that I wouldn't be able to catch him, but haha, -ha, I did. Gotcha. Gotcha. There we go. Oh, no problems here. No problem, this. I tried to sound way too cool there for a second. I'm sorry. I won't do that again. Okay, okay, but the, but the, okay, Uncle Dude Sauce, but the bed is still on. Like, okay, if Mega Man, I mean, not Mega Man, if Xenoblade 2 Definitive Edition comes out before Xenoblade X, I will record myself hitting the woe, and I will post it to all my social media. And I'm not going to give any context for it. This is going to be like, here's a video of me hitting the woe. Deal. If Xenoblade X Definitive Edition comes out, then you will. Then it's gonna be you who hits the woe. Got it? Actually, now I can do this. I don't even know how the woe goes. All I know is that it's one of those stupid TikTok dances. Go to the next fire festival or dash. Con You'll go to the next fire festival or dash con. Okay. <laughs> oh no 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 no! We're, we're... No, I don't want you wasting thousands upon thousands of dollars. So you know, we'll we'll, we'll just stick with hitting the woe. Besides, we don't know if there's ever gonna be another dash con after whatever the hell happened in 2015. Whoosh.
I know I said I'd do all these bosses with no weaknesses, but you know what? Change of plans. Woo! Managed to get him. Got him. There he goes. Ugh. Getting too many damn pings. Honestly, I should probably just leave Discord servers that ping everyone fucking constantly. Be like, hey, cut that shit out. I've been thinking about raiding someone tonight. Let's see who's live before we make that decision. Sonic! Sonic! You know, my favorite Twitch VTuber has been offline recently. I'm just like, I really hope she's okay. Sonic! Ha, huh, yeah! Sonic! Is that what he's saying? No, 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 really. I need to know if he's actually saying Sonic. Or if I'm just being a fucking weeb. Oh yeah, Vine Sauce Joel? Yeah, he's been... Oh, he, he was on break for a while? Doesn't he usually do that where he just disappears for like months at a time and then he comes back? You know, kind of like the streamer version of Cyber Shell. Pretty much, yeah. I knew it. I'll be surprised if you know who Cyber Shell is. Anyways, here's another anime cutscene. What's our current situation? Commander! Where's that red maverick that wiped out Garma's, Garma's unit? I'm sorry, he's inside that door. You mean they leave now? I'll take care of this personally. <laughs> By yourself, Commander? I don't want any more of my people being sacrificed. God, even when he was a good guy, Sigma sounds like a villain. Oh, hey, and here's Zero. Hey, Zero, you're looking a little devilish today.
Yeah. I'll answer that question after the cutscene. And after I explain some Mega Man lore. But yeah, Zero used to be evil. Who knew? Commander Sigma. Incredible. Now I'm certain there's no one who's a match for the commander. What? Take that red maverick to the repair center and, and call Dr. Kane. I wish to have that maverick studied. <sighs> commander, are you okay? Silence! Man, he was a... Sigma was a little bit of a dick even before he became maverick. Anyways... Uh, what you think will get announced first? Mario Kart 9, Bloodborne 2, or Xenoblade? I feel like Mario Kart 9 has a good chance of happening. You know, give it about a year or two. Anyways, so, uh, to explain some Mega Man lore here. Zero was created by Dr. Wily. However, because Zero was kind of batshit insane, Wily sealed away Zero for, you know, a hundred years. And he was discovered by the Maverick Hunters. And eventually, you know, Sigma got in a fight with him, and uh, Sig and Zero passed on the Maverick virus to Sigma, and that's how this crazy, fucking, wacky shit started. Ah! I, I could go into way more depth about Mega Man lore, but I don't want to bore you fucking people for now. But yeah, Mega Man lore is some pretty interesting deep shit. Check out... Are you ready for round two? Blah, 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 blah. Who cares what you have to say, Sigma? Sigma nuts! Behold, X, I am no longer Sigma. I am Sugma. Sugma? What does that mean? Sugma nuts! <laughs> That's my favorite Twitter post. Or it's one of my favorite Twitter posts. Please give Legends a chance. They're both very good. I, If they make a Legends Legacy Collection, then I will. I mean, wait, has the Battle Network Legacy Collection come out yet? When does that come out? April 14th. Gosh darn it. Two days before my birthday. Prepare, Prepare to, to become, become Space Dust. dust. And then we have my favorite final boss in... Well, not my favorite final boss in the X-Series. Uh, this is pretty up there for my favorite final boss in the X-Series. Probably my second favorite, but... You can't beat X-1's final boss. The only thing I know about the Legend series is that Tron Bond is the most popular character. There we go. 
God, I love this fight so much. It's so good. You have to basically worry about two different bosses. The end. Okay, no, never mind. He's just gonna go for the stupid laser attack. Oh my god. Well, there's a... Uh, there goes a... Uh, battle ready Sigma, I suppose. I don't know what this form of Sigma's called. And with that, that's what she wrote. And we are done with Mega Man X4. And consequently, the X series for now. Hee hee hee, something something, I don't care. Sorry if I got a little tilted during the stream, it's just that, you know, a little bummed out that, uh, you know, I've gotten rusty over the years of not playing this game. So, uh, that's fun. Always fun to discover that, you know, you've lost your touch. Blah, 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 blah. Who cares? General sacrificing himself for the greater good. But yeah, this was the game to reveal that, uh, this is the game that revealed that, uh, Zero was a creation of Dr. Wily. Hinted all the way back in X2. Or two games ago. Whatever. You know what I mean. Anyways, last sip of my uh, water. <sighs> so, this is what happened to me. This is my fate. I couldn't save anyone after all. <laughs> Iris! This fucking goddamn voice acting. Good. God almighty. This fucking voice acting, good god. Could they not find, like. Ugh. Iris, did we rip once all turn out to be Mavericks, Mavericks after, after all. all? Did we Mavericks all turn out to be Mavericks after all? Ugh, whatever. This fucking game. Like, okay. So, final thoughts on Mega Man X4. Uh, probably my second favorite in the X series. You know, Mega Man X1 has a lot of nostalgia for me personally. So, you know, it'll, it'll never be toppled. But X4 comes really damn close. If that's, and it's only because Zero is a fully fledged playable character. You know, he's not, uh, he's not a gimmick like an X3 He's his own actual fully fledged playable character with his own upgrades, with his own special abilities, and his own campaign. Like, that's neat. I think that's really cool. Unfortunately, I do think that X4 suffers a little bit from being a bit too easy, but hey, you know, as long as it's fun, I couldn't care less if, you know, I couldn't care less if it's easy as long as it's fun and you saw me almost tear out my hair because of fucking storm owl i almost said storm eagle <laughs> that's x1 <laughs> but yeah overall fun game love it love it love it love it I, I could go for a little water break. I'd probably have to take a shower soon. But, eh, whatever. <sighs> Anyways, I'm in the middle of making a new video. Uh, right now it's in the script process, so, you know. Uh, that's always fun. Uh, I'm on... The first draft is done. I just, I just have to have someone look over it and, you know, point out point out some things. You know, give me suggestions on what to improve, what to add, what to take away. You know, that all fun stuff. And for me, for whatever reason, I like to write my scripts like I'm writing a college essay. So, that's always fun. Thank you for playing. And thank you for making the game, Capcom.
<laughs> the battle has ended, but for some reason, Zero's memories of the past continue to haunt his mind. As a hunter, it is his duty to go after those mavericks. At the same time, he knows that it is his destiny to defeat his friend one day. Two different people, two different fates. In the future, Zero's decision will lead to two great hunters to tragedy. The future is coming. In the next game! Mega Man X5, which I am not going to be playing immediately because, you know, I, don't I want to avoid burnout. So, you know, we're going to head over back to the loading screen and we're just going to end things off. So, you know. <sighs> What more can I say? You know, we've had a lot of fun. Uh, things are going great. Have yourself... Actually, let's find someone to raid. Who can I raid? And once again, uh, when I raid someone, don't be cringe. Don't be cringe. <laughs> don't, do, don't do stupid shit because that reflects back onto me. And, uh, you know, just have some fun. So, let's see. Who can I raid today? Uh, let's see here. Uh, I suppose I could raid this person. Yeah. Yeah, I think I'll raid this person. Uh, actually, let me check. Actually, I'll raid this person instead. All right, you know the drill. Have fun. Have yourself a great day, night, evening, whatever it is, wherever you are. Uh, take care of yourselves. Have fun. And, you know, just just don't be cringe wherever I send you. So, yeah. Have fun. Later, nerds. <laughs>